Hey guys, just for you. Today we are going to talk about the new update so has just released in the game and uh they have brought back some stuff so uh let's cover that and also just a little disclaimer I am not going to be talking about the changes they have done with the bugs and everything but I'm just going to talk about the major things they have changed. So uh let's get on with this update. Alright guys, we are here and this, um, they have added a new spin wheel skin. So they have added the black feather and if you have not known already, there is a version, like the white version, it's called Sammy's Feather, which is pretty rare in this game. And yeah, they have made like a black version or the evil version as you can say and yeah, it is called the black feather and it is 0.5% chance so I'm gonna be showcasing the skin. And uh, if you're wondering how you get this feather, you can just spin the wheel, and you can spin it each and every 24 hours. So yeah, uh, if you're wondering why you may not spin, you might have to wait 24 hours to spin it. So uh, let me showcase the black feather. See you there. Okay guys, this is the black feather, and as you can see, it is heavily based on the feather called Sammy's feather. They have added a bit of, you know, like rings around the feather, which is pretty sick. And yeah, overall this is a pretty cool skin. I, I would see um, it's heavily sought for and it could be quite valuable in the training realm. So this is the Black Feather. Now let's move on to the new event that Zoe has just added. Alright guys, we are here and this is the Chainsaw Man event. So if you have not known already, they have added this back and yeah, so if you have not known, the last Chainsaw Man event was kind of a flop, nobody really liked the event at all and none of the skins were tradable, which is honestly very sad and uh, yeah, quite bad. So in this event, I don't think it's really that crazy, I don't really think it's really that sought for, but uh, they have added like new skins with kill effects and emotes, which are pretty cool in my opinion. and. To be honest, I think it would be worth grinding this event, so uh, let's cover what they have added. So as you can see here, they have added the Chainsaw Man Kenobo, same from last event. We have the kill, I mean, we have a Yen, we have another kill effect, the Pachita kill effect, same as the last one. We have Yen, and uh, uh, we have the Pachita Kurosugama, it was from the last event, but it was pretty cool, I actually enjoyed this skin a lot. We have the pumpkin spider kill effect, so I think that's pretty cool. It's kind of Halloween based, but I don't know why it's in a Chainsaw Man event, but apparently it's there. We have a black backflip, which is pretty cool. Uh, this uh, this is a Chainsaw Man kill effect, it was also from the last event, but uh, yeah, it's pretty cool too. We have the volcano, which is also, they have just added, and it's pretty cool, so yeah. This is a new kill effect they have added, and uh, this, as you can see, this is a, a chainsaw that is attached to your arm, and it's pretty awesome in my opinion, so, yeah, you can get that from 600 kills, I believe, I don't think that that's too much, but, yeah, you can get that for 600 kills, and I think that's like the, you know, the main attraction of this event, which is a Seishtas, as you can see here, the, the chainsaw Seishtas, which is pretty insane, so, uh, alright guys, if you're seeing this right now, that means you're at the end of the video, and I really appreciate you if you've, um, hit this point in the video and yeah thank you very much and I will be showcasing all the new Chainsaw Man skins in the next video so yeah I'll be I'll be doing a showcase on the next video so um stay tuned for that and I'll see you guys later peace <laughs>